Hey friends, Cole here. Thank you for joining me. And I wanted to show a couple of my favorite neck stretches and these can be done anywhere. You can do them um, seated, seated, <laughs> seated um, up on a block. You can do it seated without a block. You can do it in your office chair or on your couch as well. So these are just some, some nice neck stretches to help find some more freedom around the neck, yeah? So one that I'll start with is just interlace the hands. Take them behind the head. So want to support the back of the neck and lean back, gaze is up. So this is opening up the front of the body, front of the throat. And kind of lean the head to the left and the right, get a little bit of movement here. And then exhale, we're gonna tuck the chin to the chest. We're gonna round everything in. And then the weight of the hands is gonna pull the neck down. So you should feel the muscles on the sides of the spine lengthening. And sometimes I can even feel this come all the way down into my mid back. So we're really rounding the back here. Oh, that feels really nice. So I tend to spend a little bit more time in this position because I get more out of it here. But then inhale, we've got to open up and reverse as well. So at least take a breath here, maybe to wiggle side to side. And then exhale, bring it back in. Let's stay for three rounds of breath. So trace how far you can feel the sensation. Do you feel it more on your left or on your right? Inhale, open up, and we'll do it one more time. Just open up, find a little movement. And then exhale. Again, three rounds of breath. Next inhale, open up. Ah. Very, very nice. All right, let's get the lateral side of the neck. So right shoulder comes down to the right ear. You may have seen me do this one before. This is my ultimate favorite. The left hand is going to reach out to the side. Maybe it comes down to the ground. Maybe it doesn't. It's up to you. Roll the shoulders back. So we'll just stay here for just a moment. We're breathing on the left side. Whenever we begin to find tightness, what we tend to do is the shoulders begin to come up begin to round. All of this is like a protection mode. It comes from our animal body and our nervous system. We're wanting to repattern that. So we're wanting to really send the breath, open the breath. Another thing we tend to do is hold the breath along with all of this. So we really want to send breath, open the breath, especially the exhale. Let the shoulders come back and begin to repattern. Now, adding on, you can turn the neck down. You can gaze up. So here is another layer. When you find spots of tension, rather than holding, can you send more breath? And then one more layer, you can reach the hand out. Oh goodness, so intense. And you can turn the fingers down and up. Wow, this is really intense for me. So the practice is not to hold the breath and not to avoid the sensation either. One more option, you can flex the hand back and like you're gonna shoot lasers out the heel of the hand. So just play with this. It's exploration of staying open, even when things get a little edgy. We can use that in lots of places in our life. Whew. One more inhale. And release. Tilt the head back up and just take a moment. I feel like the whole left side of my body is kind of ringing in a good way. We have a brachial plexus is this whole nerve arena, this whole nerve area up here that's also stretching. So lots of sensation. And let's switch sides. Left ear towards the left shoulder. I had to think about that for some reason. And then watch the tendency to start to round forward, but keep it open. Right hand reaches out. Fingertips come down to the ground, maybe. Maybe they stay up. And take a moment here, just breathing. So we're just meeting the right side of our neck. Hello. Expect it to be different than the other side, because it most likely will be. 
And then maybe you begin to move the head. Maybe. The arm as well. And when you find some tension, stop and stay. Send breath into those tight spaces. Let the shoulders fall away from the ears. And relax into this. Can you relax into the tension? A couple more rounds of breath. And then slowly lifting the head up. Closing the eyes and just feeling the sensations now on the right side of the neck. Mm. Very nice. And then one more. This will kind of get into this area with the rhomboids and the traps as well. So coming from the base of the skull all the way down. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah. Left hand to the left behind the head. Let's take the right hand down to the ground. So we're gonna do this kind of like twisted curl. So exhale, we're gonna twist and curl left elbow towards the left knee. So we're not actually coming all the way down, though you can. I'm just gonna twist up high here. So this whole area is stretching on this left quadrant here. Inhale, open and lift. Like you're gonna lean back, open the heart, and then exhale, curl. Let's stay here for a couple rounds of breath. Breathing into the tension. And then inhale, open. And once more, exhale. Inhale here. Let the weight of the hand help this neck stretch. Exhale. And inhale, open. Let's come all the way up. And we'll switch sides. Right hand behind the right head. Behind. <laughs> right hand behind the head. Behind the right head, not the left head. Anyway, I'm starting to get really relaxed. These neck stretches are opening me up. Now I'm just going to start mumbling. Inhale. Exhale, curl. Right elbow down. And again, maybe the elbow comes down to the knee and you're feeling it here. I feel that more in my low back. If I stay higher, I feel it more up in my neck. But our bodies are so different. We feel it in different places. So see where it's going on for you. Inhale, lift up. And exhale round. Stay here. Inhale, lift. And exhale round. So see if you can pinpoint where the sensation is. I can feel it. Yeah, I can pinpoint where it is. At the, in my mid trap. And all of this is connected. So the traps and the rhomboids and the muscles in the neck. Again, inhale. Let's go down for one more time. Exhale. And inhale, come all the way up. And just wiggle your shoulders around. Give your head some swivel. So those are some of my go-to neck stretches, and it can be done really quickly. You could even do those, you know, a little bit quicker if you had a little bit of space. Maybe they all resonated, maybe just one of them did. So just take what, take what you can, take what feels good in your body and leave, and leave the rest, yeah? And thank you so much for joining me. I hope you found a little bit of relief. Again, my name's Cole. Uh, please like and subscribe to our channel here at Yoga TX. We are here trying to serve up the yoga medicine for you. I will see you next time.